Hi, soap fans. It's Allie. I just made a fresh batch of my Cricut soap, and I'm so, so happy with how it turned out. If you watched the original Cricut making of video, the first batch that I made turned out a little weird because of the fragrance oil, but I kind of adjusted myself and anticipated the weirdness this time around, and I'm so happy with how this design turned out. Look at this, look at how cool these swirls are i mean since it's a floral fragrance it moved the batter really quick and it got thick so i kind of just worked around that and kept the uh colored portions of it thick and kept the uh, fragrance oil out of the white part of the batter and it just made the white part kind of swim around inside the soap and create this cool effect. I just think these look so neat and it's really perfect for the fragrance too because it's green apple and lavender and uh, sage. And I think it's very representative of Cricut. I think it's a, just, this is such a good fragrance. And I think the design is so much better than the first batch. Um, I really like the tops too. Too. like it kind of just turned out neat and swirly and kind of it almost to me looks like little little buds of lavender peeking out from the green uh, the green of the plant I just think these look so nice I wanted to share with you <laughs> these are fresh cut I haven't cleaned them up or anything these are um, gosh they're only maybe two days old so they're still in their curing process but they will be ready for spring 2016. How cool are these?